Hello. 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 Hi. Hello, Toy. Hello, teacher. Hi. How are you today? I'm fine. You're fine. I'm good too. Thank you. So I already um actually I I um I already inspected okay your the one that you send okay um an audio audio recording okay all yeah. about our lesson last time and I I was so amazed because I um I I do understood what you said in there okay yeah yeah because there would be already a clear um clear um uh, what is one pronunciation okay yes. so keep that up okay continue doing that one because um just what i have told you in english it doesn't mean if you are good talking english it doesn't mean that you should have to speak um fast okay so it doesn't mean yeah. like that because if you are a good um communicator you should have to convey the message okay that you wanted to inform yeah the one that who are uh, the one that uh, listen the one that uh listening to you okay so it's not that you need to talk fast okay yeah. because it's um it's a waste of time talking to a person very fast if he or she doesn't understand what you are talking about right so it's good to hear um person or an individual talking clearly okay again with the so called intonation there would be the falling and rising intonation okay the one that you did just a while ago during an audio okay uh, uh i i i heard there that there would be rising and then falling intonation so that would be good so we will be going to do a lot of that okay in the near future for our lesson toy okay okay so keep it and uh, sooner you will be a very good speaker a very good speaker and uh, i'm positive uh, i'm positive that you can do that one okay okay yeah. so let me share uh our presentation to you now okay i hope you can see the presentation toy can you see it yes i can yeah see. okay can you read the presentation yes or no yeah. Yes. Yes, very good. Okay. So now we are going to continue the lesson that we had last time. It's all about how do I buy ticket? Now for a review, okay, for just a review. Okay, so we are going to um review the word transport. So if you're talking about transport, that means it's a form of transportation. An example of that one would be a bus, okay, a plane, a, a boat, okay. So that would be an example of transportation, wherein, um, wherein, uh, you will going to, um, to what is one? You will going to transfer using that transportation from yeah. one place to, to to another that's why the word transport or transportation taken from the word transfer okay yeah. transfer yeah. because yeah you are transferring from one place to the other place using the transport okay okay so this time we will be going to continue Okay, for the listening, how to get information. Okay, so if we are going to ride, let's say, for example, ride a, um, a train, okay, or a tram, okay, because in London, they call that one a tram. Uh, here in the Philippines, we call that one a train, okay, and then 
if uh, uh if i'm not mistaken other countries like the okay like uh, maybe in um in uh, in yeah in other country they call the tram or the train as they have the so called subway okay they call that one also a subway so i want to ride in a subway okay so subway means it's a form of transportation or it's it's a train that's below the ground or under the ground right because sometimes yeah. a train okay is just only uh, above the ground right so that would be a train yeah. but the subway is underground so it's uh it's under under yeah underground so that would be a subway here in the philippines we don't have a subway but we have now uh, ongoing construction of a subway what about in vietnam Do yeah you have subway? Much... ah you no. don't have yet a subway okay yeah. uh here in the philippines uh, it's ongoing. The construction is in going. Okay, so it's going to be there underground. Okay, when yeah. I uh, when I visited Viet, uh, no, not not Vietnam, at Thailand, they have a subway. Okay, so yeah. they have subway. Uh, actually, they have subways, and um, it's going to be very fast. Okay, so that yeah. means of transportation is a very good transportation if you wanted to transfer uh, from a far place, right? Or from, from your place going to a far places, right? So that would be a very good means of transportation. If you are going, if you, if you would like to go to a province, so maybe you have to, to ride a train or a tram or to ride the subway, okay? Okay. Yeah. But maybe if you're just going to ride a bus, so that would be somewhere within the city, okay, or somewhere that's uh, within within a particular uh, place within the city, okay? Yes. Okay. Now, we have here, Matt just has just arrived in Osaka, Japan, okay? So, Matt is a, um, he is not from... He's not from Japan, okay? But he traveled going to Osaka, Japan. So he wants to get around by a public transport, okay? So because he's new in Osaka, Japan, so he wanted to understand the process, okay, of riding a public transport. And... um. One of the public transport that he would like to ride is the train or the tram. Okay, so Kumiko, Kumiko is an information officer that helps him. Okay, Kumiko yes. explained to Matt on how to ride a public transport, especially the train. Yes, because sometimes. Uh, just like look at this one, huh? just like in the picture, uh, sometimes mm. there are no English interpretations. Okay? Yeah. So let's say, for example, if you don't know how to read the Chinese characters, so how are you going to do that, right? So how are you going to buy ticket if you don't know how to read them, right? But yeah. of course, based on international standards toy, so all of the uh let's say for example terminals okay terminals um they they uh, it, it's it's a mandate of the world organization okay of all the transports that they should have to provide all the passengers especially visitors coming from other countries that there would be there would be an english translations okay because sometimes especially if you are a foreigner you came from other uh you, you came from other place and you just visit in that particular country so it's very important that there would be something that you uh you understand okay okay now let's try to listen to the conversation of Matt and Komiko and after the conversation, we have to tick 
the information that Matt asked about. Are you ready to listen, Toy? I'm ready. Yes. Okay. So let's try to, I'm going to play the audio presentation just for a while. Mm -hmm. Where is my, okay, it's here. Oh, wait, wait. Okay. Mm -hmm. Where is it? I lost it. Okay, it's here. So listening, okay, that would be 22. It's here. Recording 22. Hello, I'd like to get some information about catching the underground, please. Yes, of course. Well, the first thing I'm not sure about is um, how do I buy a ticket? Okay. Uh, I just have to pause that one for a while, okay? So I would like to inquire or ask about how to get uh, uh, a public transport, especially underground, okay? So he used the word underground. So maybe th this one is a subway, right? Okay, so um, on our, on our, on our, um, lessons okay um on our uh lessons okay with this particular lesson we will be going to understand what are the terminologies about uh about the underground about the subway so we will be going to learn that one as we go to our lesson okay so let's try to continue ah yes well to begin you should look for a ticket machine you can find them at the station okay and um, you can you can use coins or notes. Any coins or notes? With coins, only 500 yen and 150 and 10. Mm, okay. You can use 1,000 yen notes in every machine. I see. And you can also find some machines where you can use 5,000 and 10,000 yen notes. How will I know which notes I can use? It will say on the machine. And some take credit card too. So, how much money... Uh, how can I tell how much money I need to put in the machine? There's a map which tells you. It's mm. above the machine. Oh, right. Mm. The big map. Yes. You can find the price. You have to... Uh, you need to choose the correct price for the place you want to go to. Oh, right. I choose the price. <laughs> what should I do next? Just catch the train? Yes. You keep ticket and insert it in the machine at the ticket gate. And will the ticket come out of the machine? Yes. It comes out of the machine. So you have to keep your ticket until you get off. And then what do I do? Give the ticket to somebody or...? No. When you arrive at the station, you have to insert the ticket into a machine again. Oh, okay. At the exit ticket gate? Yes the exit ticket gate, but your ticket will not come out. Okay, I understand. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, so it's done already. The conversation between Matt, who is a, um, a foreigner, okay, uh, new in that particular place in Osaka, Japan, and she uh, he talked to Komiko, who is an information officer. Okay, now let's try to check or take the information that Matt wanted to ask Tomiko. Okay, that Matt asked about um, with that particular information. Okay, is it A, timetables? Is Matt uh, asked about the timetables or the train timetables? Letter B, about the ticket machines? Or about letter C, late night train services, letter D, ticket prices, or letter E, train and bus connections. So what do you think would be the, the one that Matt wanted to ask? Okay. What do you think, Toy? Ticket machines. Okay. The first one. Of course, he asks about ticket machines. Okay, where do I buy tickets? He 
He mentioned yeah. that one, right? Okay, where yeah. do I buy tickets? So according to Kamiko, there would be ticket machines wherein you can be able to insert notes in there, right? Okay, so we will be going to understand what do we mean, uh, what do we mean by notes, okay? Next. Yeah. What else aside from ticket machines do we have also? <laughs> it's ticket prices, okay? So he was able also to ask about the ticket prices, okay? Aside from that, do we have still? No more or do we have? No more. No more. Very good. Good job, Toy. Okay, so he just only um focus okay on asking only on the ticket machines okay yeah. because there would be ticket machines in there but of, but of course uh you are if you are new it's your first time in that particular country or city maybe and you don't know how to use that so therefore it's very important for you to ask questions am i right okay so you don't need to to say that oh i know that okay so you don't you don't need to say that because maybe it was written in in chinese so if you don't know chinese so it's hard for you to understand where what are you going to do right what are you going to input so it's very important that you should have to understand the process on how to insert tickets on the machines right okay and of course, aside from that, he was able to ask about the prices. Okay, so he was uh, he was able to mention about how much would be that be okay. How much would be the the one that I am going to provide? Okay, that I am going to insert to the ticket machines, right? Okay, okay. so according to Kamiko, there you can see okay above the machine. Okay, because he uh, he mentioned also how much how much notes which I am going to insert to the ticket machines. So according yeah. to Nico, there you can see the uh the amount okay of the uh of the of that particular um price okay um it depends on your destination also okay good job toy next now. Let's try to read the instructions for using Osaka Underground. Okay, so we have now the so-called underground. Okay, so we will be going to understand the word underground again. Okay, so again, if you try to talk about underground on our own words, we can say that it's under the ground. That's why it's called underground. Right, Toy? Okay. Yeah. Okay, so let's try to listen again and complete the gaps with the word or number you hear. Okay, so number one has been given because you can use these coins in all ticket machines. So there would be 500 yen and number letter A is given. So that would be 100 yen. And what about this one? And then we have also 10 yen. Okay? So let's try yeah. to listen again. Recording 22. Hello. I'd like to get some information about catching the underground, please. Yes, of course. Well, the first thing I'm not sure about is... Um, how do I buy a ticket? Ah, Good. yes. Well, to begin, you should look for a ticket machine. You can find them at the station. Okay. And um, you can you can use coins or notes. Yes. Any coins or notes? With coins, mm. only 500 yen and 150 and 10. Mm. Okay. You can use 1,000 yen notes in every machine. I see. And you can also find some machines where you can use 5,000 and 10,000 yen notes. How will I know which notes I can use? It will say on the machine. And some take credit card too. So, how much money... Um, 
How can I tell how much money I need to put in the machine? There's a map which tells you. It's above the machine. Oh, right. The big map. Yes. You can find the price. You have to... Uh, you need to choose the correct price for the place you want to go to. All mm. oh, right. I choose the <laughs> price. <laughs> what should I do next? Just catch the train? Yes. You keep ticket and insert it in the machine at the ticket gate. And will the ticket come out of the machine? Yes. It comes out of the machine. So you have to keep your ticket until you get off. <laughs> and then what do I do? Give the ticket to somebody or...? No. When you arrive at the station, you have to insert the ticket into a machine again. Oh, okay. At the exit ticket gate? Yes, the exit ticket gate. But your ticket will not come out. Okay, I understand. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, so uh, I would like to ask some questions, Toy. Uh, in Vietnam, have you experienced riding on a train? On the train, when I go, uh, go to the uh, uh, the other town, I ah. buy first. I buy yeah. before I go. Yeah, so you were able to experience riding on a train. Now, would you kindly tell me some of the process on how to ride a train in Vietnam? Okay, maybe if I I I can go there. So, so that I do have uh, an idea on how to ride a train, right? So, yep. just like the just like in Osaka, Japan. So, these are the process on how you can be able to get into the underground, right? Yeah. Okay, but what about in Vietnam? So, is this uh, uh, is in Vietnam the same also the same process also? in uh, Osaka, Japan, that wherein you are going to find for a ticket machines, okay? And then after that one, you need to choose the right price before you are going to ins insert a note or a coin, right? Yeah. Okay? And then after that one, once you inserted already the, the, the coins or the notes, because the machines can also accept coins, okay, aside from the notes. Okay, so once you inserted that one already, so there would be a ticket that comes out from the machine, right, Toy? Then after that one, according to Kamiko, you should have to keep your ticket until, until such time that you were going to arrive in your destination. So once you arrive, you need to insert again the ticket, okay, on the machine. And yeah. then it will not come out anymore, okay? Now... I would like to, I would like to, uh, of course, to inform you that here in the Philippines, actually, we do have that one. Okay, same process. Yeah, same process. We go to the ticket machine. Uh, there would be two types of ticket machines, okay, that you can buy. You can buy through a uh, ticket machines or you can buy a ticket through a teller, okay? Uh -huh. But of course... Um, you should have to look for um, uh, to look for if there would be a lot of persons uh, falling in line, okay? Uh, falling in line because sometimes ticket machines there would be a lot a lot of a lot of passengers waiting for their turn for that particular ticket machine. So you have to transfer to the teller. Okay, if you have seen that there would be a lot of people falling in line for the ticket machine, okay? So it's either you can use or you can buy your ticket to the teller, okay? Because it's also the same. Or you can you can insert your notes or your coins at the ticket machine, okay? Yeah. So that would be our process here in the Philippines. What about in Vietnam? Do you have do we have the same process? In Vietnam, don't have ticket machines. Ah, okay. Because, uh, uh, Vietnam only have the train station. Uh, they, they, they train for everybody from this province to another province. Mm. So, for, for the highway. Okay. So, yeah. 
So you, uh, they, they don't have, they don't have ticket. ticket. Yeah, okay. Yeah. So they don't yeah. have ticket. Everybody, but, yes. Anybody can buy ticket online or buy ticket. Ah, mm. okay. So it's online. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> so it's going to be. So so in paying, you can also pay online. Yeah, I see. Ah. That. Oh, that would be. Yeah. Okay. If you want to go to your hometown, you need to prepare everybody first before you go. So they, they can buy ticket online or um, I'll go there to, to buy, buy ticket. ticket. Ah, so it can also online or it can also uh, in person. So you can also buy ticket on the tailor, right? Yeah. Ah, okay. Oh, that would be nice because if you don't want to fall in line, okay, if you don't want to fall in line, so you can buy ticket online. So that would be very convenient, right? Oh, that would yeah. be nice. Okay. So, yeah. Okay. Here in the Philippines, we don't have online. <laughs> but, uh -huh. yeah, but you can buy ticket that's already been, uh, we call that one as a prepaid ticket. Okay. Let's say, for example, if you usually, let's say if your work is, you need to to ride the train every day so you can buy uh, maybe in advance, okay, in just only one ticket, you can use that one every day. So you can buy maybe for, what, for good for one month. So there's, there's no need for you to buy uh, every day. So you can, you can, you can, um, you can pay it the, you can pay it the teller telling you that, oh, I, I have to pay one month already. So they will be going yeah. to reload that one good for one month. So you will be using that one from time to time up to one month. Then once it's already been consumed, so you are going to pay again another one month. So there would be like that, but we don't have yet online. Okay. Yeah. Because in the in Vietnam don't have the the train for the, the train for for the uh, within the city. Ah uh, yeah okay. Only um, in province. Ah uh, yeah. In province, so yeah. To another province, so. Yeah, so it's going to be very it's far, far places. Yeah, yeah okay. Yeah, yeah. so. Buy for the monthly or yearly. Yeah, actually, here in the Philippines, we have only one one train that's um that's uh what is one transporting uh passengers through province. Okay, just only one. Okay, but we have also within the city. Okay, so we have train stations within the city. So yeah. that will be it. And then sooner, we will be going to have an underground or we call that one as a subway. Okay? Yeah. yeah. In Vietnam, okay. they, uh, they are building for the metro, metro, you know, metro system. Yeah. Mm. They, they, they are building, but not yet finished. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Oh, so you have to wish me good luck also because I have applications in Vietnam. <laughs> so <laughs> if, if ever I will be accepted, so I can go there, right? So that's why yeah. I, I ask, I ask what's the process, okay? Because uh, if I can go there, okay, if I can teach there in Vietnam, so that would be nice so that I do have uh, an idea already on what to do, right? Yeah. yeah, so I hope, I hope so that the schools uh, in Vietnam uh, were going to hire me to teach there, okay? <laughs> because okay. I have applications, okay? Yeah. When will be, start. yes, when will be the start of the next school year? Is it, it's going to be on the May or it's going to be on August? The start. Oh. Of the the start of the the school year or oh, school, let's May. say for May. Yeah. Ah. Okay. So the end end of the, uh, after that, the children have two or three 
Man Pade Shumba. Okay. Uh, yeah, so that will be it, right? Oh, we will be disconnected after nine minutes, Toy, so we have to go back. Okay, so that would be nice because, um, yeah, so I hope so. I hope so. God will going to permit me, okay? And uh, and I hope, and I hope uh, I can be there, okay? And uh, yeah. of course, I can, I can teach you there also. <laughs> yeah, okay. And... Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know yet. Because, yeah, I don't know yet. Uh, there would be a lot of. Uh, I am considering Hanoi because there are also schools in Hanoi that I applied to. Uh, in um, uh, in uh, what is one? The uh, the the what is one? The 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 Saigon City. Saigon City is. Ho Chi Minh City. So Ho Chi Minh City like, is the capital city of Vietnam, right? Yeah, uh, I think you have so much the the, the children in Ho Chi Minh City, no? Uh -huh. Really? Yeah. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Children in Ho Chi Minh City are in Hanoi. Ah, okay. I'm not in Hanoi, uh, Ho Chi Minh City now. Yeah. Um. Actually, um. It's not yet because I just send applications. Okay. I just send an application, um, to different schools in uh, private schools. Actually, in uh, I do have in Hanoi. I do have also in Ho Chi Minh City and some other provinces in uh, in Vietnam. Okay. So whichever would be the first one to call me and interview me. And if ever I I um I uh, I can pass, okay. So they will going to hire me. Right? Yeah, of course, of course. If ever I can, I can, I can also teach you online. Same, I can also teach you online there, right? Okay. Yeah, you can teach because me. if you you stay in Ho Chi Minh City, I will you, uh, I will go, go to see you and. Yeah, so that yeah. would be nice. So that would be a nice idea, Toy, because I wanted to I wanted to experience teaching abroad. Okay. Yeah. So if ever if ever God permitted me and uh, helps me to achieve that dream or goal, so um, I will. Okay, and I will going to grab that opportunity. But of course, um. Uh, I couldn't say because uh, it depends on him. It depends on God, right? So whatever would be his plan, so I am going to follow that one. So if 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 God permitted me uh, and helps me to pass the interview, okay, and uh, yeah, and uh, and the schools will going to accept me there because they are there. Um, there are three schools in in uh, Ho Chi Minh City. Okay, they're opening for a Filipino teachers actually. Okay, so yeah. they're they're hiring a lot of Filipino teachers from the Philippines. Okay, so if ever, if so, ever. Yeah, I think just here is the uh, it will pass. Uh, only the problem with the salary save me after interview. They, no, actually, they, salaries are good compared to the Philippines toy. Yeah, uh, because, yeah. yeah, because the exchange, yeah, the exchange of peso and uh, baht, right? So, or no, the uh, uh, what is that? Not a baht, but it's a it's a Vietnam dam, right? So the exchange Vietnam of dam. yeah Vietnam dam and peso is quite different. Okay, there would be difference. Okay, because what the center you apply? What come again? What the center? What the school? Um. I forgot the schools because I do have three schools in Ho Chi Minh City and I guess two schools in Hanoi. Okay, so uh, I'm not familiar with the school and it's it's an international school actually. I applied uh, international schools. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's a language school. Okay, schools actually uh, offering English to Vietnamese students. Okay, yeah. so hopefully... Uh, 
hopefully, hopefully. So, if ever, if ever, God will going to give me chance. Okay? Yes. So, yes. I will inform you. Okay? I will inform you, Toy, so that we can be able to see each other there. And yes. you can be my guide, my tour guide. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, and uh, you can you can help me find a uh, a place, right? Um, yes. I think, I think uh, there would be, yeah, if ever, one of the benefits um, that the school can give to a teacher, a Filipino teacher or a foreign teacher, would be they will going to pay for the rent of the apartment. Yes. Okay, so okay. that would be yeah. one of the benefits. And then mm -hmm. there would be a free lunch. So it's a good, it's a good opportunity. So aside from your, aside from your monthly salary, so there would be, uh, um, there would also be, they were going also to, to shoulder the expenses for, um, for the, the, what is one? The process of your paper, like visa. So there would be assistance of that okay hmm. so that would yeah. be good so that would be a good uh benefits right yeah i see in the the land uh english school uh the teacher has assistant oh really yes because oh, you cannot uh, because you cannot stop uh, speaking with me the the assistant ah. is that you how you can okay. help with the children, your children when when they uh, they under understand your me. Oh. So uh, with the my 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 baby class held uh, the main teacher and the uh, assistant. Uh, uh, yeah, oh. what assistant? If a big class, I think uh some some class have two assistants. Really? So that would be good. Yeah, you know. You know, Ila, Ila Center. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. In the Ila Center, you, uh, one main teacher have 20 students. Uh, 20, uh, 20 and over 20 students. students. You, uh -huh. have, you have two assistants. Two. Oh, yes. that would be nice. You know, uh, that would be nice, Toy. Actually, here in the Philippines, 20 mm. students. Only one teacher. <laughs> yeah. It's but just only the know, main teacher. Yeah, but okay. the, 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 the school, the you uh, uh, I'll pay the free very high in Ila, you know? Ila oh. very high. Ah, so that is why. Uh, that is why. Yes, okay. my baby the uh, study in uh, I can risk uh, center around uh, 11, uh 12, 12 students, uh, one wow. teacher and one assistant. assistant. Oh, that uh, would be good. So, if ever yeah. I, yeah, so that would be good actually, Toy. Uh, why? Because it's not hard for you, it's not hard for the teacher to teach because. For just uh, for just that number of students, that would be good if you have one assistant teacher. Okay. Yeah, and, because uh, I want to the small lab, you know, uh, small lab. You, the my baby can the uh, communicate with the, the teacher. So oh, much. see. Because, yeah, because yeah. you twenty with ten, not the that is That's, different. Yeah. Okay, yeah. because there would be a lot of students inside the classroom. But if, if it is just only small, small, uh, small group of students, so there would be chances that all of them, okay, yeah. have the chance to be able yeah. to to us uh, to be able to to talk okay so teachers will yeah. going to encourage them to oh you have to talk you have to you have to do this one you have to do this one right uh, yeah. unlike with a big big uh, group of students okay because sometimes one hour is not enough for them right for all of um, them <laughs> one point five yeah one point five hours yeah. in one subject for every subject. Yeah, one five because now see the up to the the last three. Mm, yeah. yeah, the last one and the last two 
only one hour of the last three units uh, yeah. pay more and <laughs> and yeah. more time to study yeah yeah actually that would be nice so hopefully 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 okay yeah. um yeah hopefully